Dear friends, thank you for joining us tonight and welcome to the 2019 Sydney Peace Prize Lecture. My name is Susan Biggs and I'm the director of the Sydney Peace Foundation. Thank you to Anne Weldon for her warm and generous welcome to country. I recognise the traditional custodians of the land and acknowledge their elders past, present and emerging. Sovereignty over this land has never been ceded and this is and always will be Aboriginal land. Thank you also to the amazing Sarah Blasco. Um, what a fantastic performance and it's so great to have her here with us tonight. She will be closing, so don't think about going early. Before I introduce the chair to the Sydney Peace Prize Foundation, Archie Law, I want to acknowledge the events of recent days. The foundation has awarded the prize to the Me Too movement because we stand with the survivors of harassment and assault. We know that to achieve peace with justice, we need to confront the issue of sexual violence and sexual harassment in all forms in all situations. We're deeply saddened and disappointed by recent reports that survivors' confidentiality had been breached in the development of a forthcoming ABC documentary. We acknowledge those who have taken full responsibility for these mistakes and urge them to make the changes that are clearly necessary to their practices to always have a do no harm approach. We stand with any survivors in this room this evening and share our distress at the pain these events have caused. If you or someone you know is experiencing violence and needs help or support, there are national and state-based agencies that can assist you 24 hours a day, seven, day, seven days a week. And there's some flyers with the resources written down at the back and we should have it up on the screen <coughs> sometime soon, I hope. It's now my great pleasure to welcome Archie Law to the microphone, the chair of the Sydney Peace Foundation. Uh, thank you, Susan, um, and welcome everybody. Um, truly delighted that everyone could be here with us this evening. Um, friends, the, the Sydney Peace Foundation exists because we believe that peace is possible and that there is no peace without justice. The peace with justice that we all want to see in our lifetimes, gender justice, social justice, ecological justice, economic justice. In spite of the seemingly overwhelming nature of these struggles, more and more it seems that justice is within our grasp. The Sydney Peace Prize is at the heart of the Sydney Peace Foundation's efforts. In the last two decades, we've been spreading the message of peace with justice alongside some of the most inspiring leaders of our time. They include Noam Chomsky, Arundhati Roy, Pat Dodson, Naomi Klein, and Joseph Stiglitz. Our job at the Foundation is to reward some of the world's greatest change makers and bring the Sydney community together to recognise these extraordinary achievements. The prize starts a vital public debate and creates a platform to ensure that these voices are heard. And by sharing these stories of vision and courage, the Sydney Peace Prize reminds us all that a peaceful, equitable and just world is possible. Tonight, the Sydney Peace Foundation is absolutely thrilled to be awarding the Sydney Peace Prize to the Me Too movement. We sincerely thank the jury for their deliberations and decisions, uh, and thank you, and they deserve a round of applause. Tonight's prize recognises the massive achievements of the Me Too movement and our guests, Tarana Burke and Tracy Spicer, are two of the leaders who have demanded that we act now to end sexual harassment and violence. The 2019 Sydney Peace Prize jury chose the Me Too movement from over 200 nominations from the community. And the Me Too movement has changed the way that we understand and talk about sexual harassment and violence. 
for highlighting its breadth and its impact around the world, in the home, in public spaces and workplaces. And for that, we sincerely thank them. Um, so thank you all for your support uh, for, for coming out tonight. We greatly appreciate it at the Foundation. And I'm sure you're going to have a terrific evening uh, celebrating the recipients of the 2019 Sydney Peace Prize. Uh, it now gives me great pleasure to welcome the Honourable Tanya Plibersek MP uh, to the stage. Thank you.